it's restarting, and it's an event that helps out the community. Bradley Weatherford has that story. Headlands Under the Oaks event has started back, and the group that puts it on tells me just what it takes to get an event like this going. Oh, this is the third year the Headland Main Street Promotions Committee has put together the Under the Oaks event, an event that has music, food vendors, a car show, and more. A lot goes into making this event happen. We line up the food vendors. We spend months accepting applications for bands um, and lining those up, working with local restaurants and shops to make sure that they're going to be open and offering specials and doing things that the whole community is going to want to come out for. Thomas says this event is huge for the local economy because of all the community support. It's one of our biggest nights of the year because it brings so many people in that wouldn't otherwise come to Headland. Um, so, you know, it's a really good event for, for all the businesses on the square. Tomlin herself owns District 37 on the square and has custom Under the Oak shirts made for the event. The first band to play in the Under the Oaks event series this year is the River Dam Band, which is a southern rock and country band. We have a great lineup, though, for the entire season, which goes through October. So check out Headland Main Street on their Facebook page and their website, and you'll see the whole list of events for the rest of the season. The event is every third Friday of each month from April to October. In Headland, Brantley Weatherford, WDHN News for the Wiregrass. In other Wiregrass news, the